weigh in time it is tuesday december 21st 2021 Okay, 200.5 pounds. All right. Just weighed myself and I am 200 I am 200.5 pounds. I don't know if that has... Uh, I don't know if that has anything to do with my hair. I took my hair out, so... Yeah. So yeah, just weighed myself and I am 200.5 pounds. And that means that I lost some weight, which I'm happy about. And um, I'll give you a recap of this last week of my weight loss journey. And uh, we'll go from there. All right, so stay tuned. Hey, it's me, Naturally Z. Welcome back to my channel where I do feature my natural hair journey as well as my fitness journey at my current age of 56 years old. And I'm coming at you today with another series which is my weight loss journey. And my goal is to lose 25 pounds by July 2022. I weighed myself about four weeks ago after having not weighed myself in over five years and I discovered that I am the heaviest I've ever been in my life and I weighed 205 pounds so with that I am looking to lose 25 pounds by July 2022 and I'm taking you guys along on the journey to do that and what I'm generally showing you is my diet I discovered it's not about just working out to get fit. You also have to focus on your diet. You cannot out exercise a bad diet. And that is what I've been trying to do for the last 20 years. And I finally have had that moment in my life where I can't do that anymore. It worked for me in the past to out exercise a bad diet but it's not working anymore. And I am now trying to refine, improve my diet in order to lose 25 pounds, be in better shape, feel better, and move better. So I'm taking you guys along as I learn how to eat better. So right now it is Tuesday, December 21st, 2021 a few days before Christmas. I know it's crazy to start your diet right before the holidays, but I was so freaked out about how much I weighed. I could not wait. So I am doing it now and I will continue this on into January. So I hope you guys come along and watch, subscribe to my channel and see someone in their 50s doing what they say they're going to do which is lose weight, and I'm gonna show you the ups, the downs, losing weight. So right now, it is Tuesday, I already weighed myself, and it is the fourth week, and I weighed in at 200.5 pounds. I lost weight from last week, which is nice, and I hope to continue the downward trajectory of losing weight, um, but when it comes to weight, that's not all that counts. Your weight will fluctuate from week to week, month to month, so I cannot just rely on weight loss. I also want to rely on losing inches, and that I will measure once a month, and I will reveal that to you monthly. So at this point right now, I am just revealing to you weekly my weight and my weigh-in and showing you how much I either lost or gained. So, uh, I'm still using a whiteboard. This is my whiteboard to 
monitor my weight loss journey and I started on November 30th now I'm at December 21 2021 and that is my weight as of Tuesday and I'm just checking it off and the reason I like to check it off is because I want to remind myself if I want to lose 25 pounds it is going to be over a long period and it will not happen overnight so I have to be practical about it and last um, I want to show you what I'm eating for this Tuesday having completed my weigh-in and I'm technically starting another week of my weight loss journey and just want to show you my breakfast that I'm having for today I'm having avocado toast and underneath the avocado is the spinach which I sauteed and I'm having it on a piece of whole wheat bread I'm also having some tomatoes that I warmed up on the stove and I'm having some blueberries it is not my usual breakfast but I want to switch it up sometimes having avocado which is very nutritious usually what I'll have is some kind of breakfast sandwich with a sausage patty cheese and um, egg on a muffin but I just want to have a variety and not just stick with the same thing so I get sick of it like for instance in the future I'll probably have some oatmeal and um, you know whatever comes to my fancy but for now I'm gonna have this avocado which I made myself put some chopped onions tomatoes um, put some cilantro and uh, black pepper and salt so let's try it mm. it's a little salty I added way too much salt to the avocado the toast was not toasted enough and the spinach which I sauteed did not pair well with the avocado toast so overall, this meal was not good, but I ate it anyway. And along on this weight loss journey, I am trying to make more of my own dishes instead of rely on prepackaged foods or frozen foods. So in this case, this was a big fail. I will make it again in the future, but not until I have Googled how to make this avocado toast. So you will not be seeing me eat this for a little while. So what I hope to accomplish besides losing weight, losing fat, losing inches is improve my cooking skills. I don't want to rely on processed food for my weight loss journey. So, and that comes with practice. So that's what I'm doing. So because this avocado toast is salty, I'm glad I have some water. Okay, so I'm going to finish off my breakfast and move forward. Hopefully, I can show you some highlights for this upcoming week into my weight loss journey. This is the first part, showing you my breakfast. And yeah, let's see what else I show you for the upcoming week of this week of my weight loss journey. So I hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, please make sure you guys give it a thumbs up questions or comments make sure you post them below and last make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and until next time this is naturally z signing out peace